Hello again, it's Brian Engel with the Lock Team at Realty One Group Choice. Our office is in Andover, Minnesota. And today's topic, as you can see on the screen behind me, is regarding lumber prices. So there's really one thing that really stopped a lot of people because it was in the news, which is lumber prices. And what I'd like to do is really kind of take a look at where are we with lumber prices. So if we take a look at our year to date, we'll see that back in January, February, March, April, May, even going into June, about halfway through June, pricing was like just crazy and it was through the roof. I mean, we had supply chain issues. Um, couldn't get lumber, couldn't get doors, couldn't get windows. There's a lot of things that really came into play that caused home prices to, to you know, basically shoot through the roof. Um, and if we look at the chart now, we're back down um, right in the 380 range. So, you know, what does that mean? So what I like to do is I like to take a his historical perspective on almost everything that we do from a real estate perspective because that helps keep it in perspective so to speak so if we zoom out and we take a look at the five-year range we're going to see that we are back to pre-pandemic pricing for lumber so that tells me that you know the people that were considering building their home and then kind of put that on the shelf and said you know what this is not a good time. I'll be honest with you. I agree. It wasn't a good time. But now pricing is coming back to, uh, can we say, a more normal range, normal price range. So really, building your next home can be a reality, especially when you combine the, the lumber prices coming back down to normal with some of the strategies that offset interest rates like the 2-1 buy down or the 3-2-1 buy down where you you actually have a more realistic or you know um, a lower interest rate for the first few years of the mortgage that should give you time to refinance when mortgage rates come back down so now that lumber prices are down there's really four key things to think about where do I want to build my next home? What do I want in it for a floor plan? What do we do with our current home? If you have a current home to sell, and we can help you with that. And then the timing of the whole situation. So, you know, building a home takes anywhere from probably five to seven months in our current market. And especially because it's winter. Um, so you've got that timing aspect and then when do you put your current home on the market to get it sold if you have to sell to build which most people do and then you know how do you manage that whole process well we've been doing this our builder that we work with that you'll work directly with has been doing this for over 40 years our team has 50 plus years combined experience so we've been doing this. We've done this a few times. I think they say this isn't our first rodeo. And uh, so we help people through that process day in and day out. And if building your next home is something you're considering, give Engel a jingle, 612-703-6899. And we will take care of you.